YouTube, Lil Marley, and this is Certified Pothead. Smoking on one of my morning uh, spliff joint. Skip the uh, skip the hoopla doos. Jump right in here, bro. Twenty days. That's all the time left to get signatures to put medical marijuana on the ballot this November. And without big donor money behind them, the grassroots organizers are working across the state to get thousands and thousands of signatures. Three News Now's Aaron Haggerty has more. I don't know real quick. Um, we have seen some shit about the baskets push to try to get the signatures uh for uh to get they to get the medical marijuana bill on the on the ballot. Um we had seen some shit that said like uh a judge in Nebraska had put in an injunction that said that uh their the way that they gotta do signatures isn't 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 fair because it gives rural Nebraska a lot of uh weight this this a uh, uh, unbalance between rural Nebraska and urban Nebraska because you need so many rural signatures and shit across uh so many counties the spread out people who have way more uh power than 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 the condensed urban population with polls showing widespread support for medical marijuana in Nebraska, supporters are just trying to get the word out. They still need people to put pen to paper. But if grit and determination and strength, um, drive, heart was what it took to get this done, we would have gotten it done a long time ago. But unfortunately... Yeah, that's right, because it, it don't take those. It takes people actually showing up. So, so, so listen... If you're in Nebraska and you want medical marijuana, y'all gonna need to like you're gonna have to take take some initiative, bro. Y'all gonna have to take some initiative. Like 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 you know what I mean petitioners ain't just gonna come to you, bro. You might you might have to you might have to look for these niggas, bro. Especially if you really want medical marijuana, bro. Fortunately, uh, we have eighty seven thousand signatures that we need to bring across the finish line on July 7th. They say they need 50,000 more Nebraskans. You can find them at Slowdown near the College World Series this week and all across the state. I'm begging people. Yo, they need 50,000 signatures, bro. There's more, there's 50,000 weed smokers in Nebraska. There's, there's, there's 50,000. Y'all just got to know me. Some of y'all gonna have to put the bongs down, bro. You know what I mean? Take a stroke, take a walk, and try to find one of these niggas and sign some papers, bro. To do their part. If every Nebraskan who supports this gets out today, tomorrow, this weekend, we will get this done. Um, but but you got to do it now. Krista Eggers is the campaign manager. For her, it's personal because of her seven-year-old son who has daily seizures. And nothing has helped him. No uh, medications, no other treatment options. And so my family faces what so many unfortunately do, which is either to be criminals um, and risk losing my child, my other child as well, um, or uprooting my family. The campaign has little funding, not common for a petition drive. We had a group of donors uh, that had committed to fund our petition, and one of them went down in, tragically was killed in a plane accident, and the other uh, was given a uh, terminal cancer diagnosis. So let's recap. Ugh, that's fucking terrible, bro. All right. So Nebraska is shit, you know what I'm saying? They try to get medical marijuana. They need they need eighty thousand signatures and shit. They got thirty thousand or some shit like that. Um, I think I think what do, what do they got? They got I think they only got like 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 three weeks, bro. They only got like three weeks to get these shits. Um, fifty thousand. It's it's not impossible, bro. But again, it's gonna take it's gonna take some stoners doing some legwork. How he got here, Governor Ricketts opposes medical marijuana and attempts to get it passed in the legislature have failed. In 2020, supporters had funding and enough signatures to get it on a ballot, but the Nebraska Supreme Court said no. The wording was technically more than one issue in a single petition. It's disgusting um, to still be here, but I'll tell you, we can't give up. 
there's no going home. We have people who are battling cancer right now who are out collecting signatures in 100 degree weather. You know, we just lost a member of our team. She was on hospice. State Senator Anna Wishart has been heavily involved in the push for years. I have so much to be grateful for that I have gotten to meet all of these people who have this courage to keep pressing on on this issue. And so my complaints seem very little compared to the struggles that other Nebraskans are going through every day. It is time that if Nebraskans want the chance to vote on this in November, you've got to do it now. Um, I, I just can't stress that enough. I'm a parent. Yeah. The governor is against y'all getting dank, bro. The legislator is against y'all getting dinked. So Nebraska, if y'all want weed, bro, y'all have to take that shit into your own hands, bro. Y'all stoners have to collectively get out there, bro, and 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 and, and get these fifty thousand, get these fifty thousand signatures, bro. If y'all can get it on the ballot, at least y'all be able to vote for it. And you know what I'm saying? Y'all y'all be able to gauge gauge the state and see where you stand. Cause let's say y'all y'all need y'all need y'all need sixty percent to the uh to get it to get it to pass and y'all fall short by like fifty eight percent. Y'all will be able to at least see where you know what I mean where where the, where the deficit is, and try to get some weed to those niggas so they can start smoking, bro. Of a child who desperately needs this option, I need people to understand that for some of us. In this fight, this is life or death. Aaron Hagerty, 3 News Now. A recent University of Nebraska Lincoln survey estimates 83% of Nebraskans support legal medical cannabis. Shit, 83%. 80% of Nebraskans support legal cannabis. There should be no reason that shit don't 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 uh pass, bro. There's no reason. 83%. Nigga, that's all of y'all. That's all y'all. Everybody in Nebraska is okay with, with weed, bro. Get that shit on the ballot, bro. Nebraska is gonna be the next way to go. Um, I'm, I'm, shit, bro. Nebraska, bro. Put down the bongs this week, man. Get out there and uh, start signing some shit.